It was swimming with it, dude. Holy smokes. Guys, what's going on? I think you're gonna enjoy this one. I'm editing this thing with the flu. Luckily, I'm on some medication. I'm trying to amp up the energy for you guys on this intro right here, but believe me, I am sick and tired at the moment. This video is the beginning of this onslaught, and uh, literally, I took off work on Saturday. Uh, yesterday was just spent all day sleeping, and so, uh, yeah, I think you guys are gonna enjoy this. I meet up with some old friends, we catch a ton of fish, and we meet up with some YouTubers that are crushing the game. I think you guys are gonna really dig it once again. Let's go ahead and get right into it. It is right. Wow. We got some uh, gear that's not really set up over here. I'm gonna grab a few rods. We finna go fishing with Bass and Bill and Chef Bad Bass. Let's go have some fun. Boom. Grab a couple reels, some baits, and we out of here. Y'all, we are just not prepared this morning, but we are on the ibuprofen. Let me tell you what, I am not feeling too hot. I've been getting lack of sleep, trying to just uh, finish up a bunch of edits for you guys and then also get to work and all this stuff. Look what else we're dealing with. Man, I'm trying to meet the guys and we gotta hit the gas station, so. So let's go ahead and get over here. I'm trying to fish. The bite rating is a seven out of 10 today on the Bass Forecast app, which is pretty sick. I think we're going to a spot where there's some bigs, and uh, today I think is gonna be a fantastic day of fishing. Well, it is shaping up to be an eventful morning. Holy smokes, I was like out of the house five different times. I had to run back in, I forgot the sunglasses. Then I'm like pulling out of the neighborhood, and I see everybody's trash and recycle bins out, and I'm like, dang! I forgot to bring those around. They're chuck full of goodies, so I went back inside. Took out the trash and recycling, now we're headed to the gas station. We're gonna have to set up rods and reels when we get to the pond and meet the guys. So anyways guys, let's fuel up, get to the ponds, and try and catch a, a donkey today. It's gonna be a ton of fun fishing with the guys. I really hope we don't get kicked out of this spot, uh, but I think there's a good chance of linking up with the monster. See you there. Y'all, we have pulled up to the destination. I'm feeling a lot better after a couple ibuprofen. Let me tell you what, throat is not a sore. Devin had us some pot roast for breakfast, baby. And I'm over here with Bass and Bill. Bill Matthews, you guys know the deal. You've seen him in the recent videos, but also his buddy Chris is down from Illinois. He down from Illinois, so we got the whole Northern fan with us, and uh, they're just as unprepared as me, thank goodness, because I figured I was going to be holding everybody up, but we're all out here rigging, having a good time, and we're going to hit this corner together. Last time, it was just me getting lucky over there in that corner pocket, but I think we're all going to cast in and see who doesn't win the lottery here with the first catch of the day. Catch you guys at the water. I'm going to set up these reels. I think the metanium has a bad backlash, so I'm glad I grabbed all three because I totally forgot about that and I probably will not be using that reel. So let me set up the SLX with not enough line on the spool and the Scorpion, and we will get rocking and rolling. Let me get uh, seven, six, and put the SLX on this bad boy. Guys, we've decided to all cast in this corner right here and see if we can't get lucky with the very first catch of the day. I mean, I'm gonna try and get on the ledge, but I don't know if it'll happen. Are you ready? Yep. All right, One, let's, let's two, cast. Three, go. Oh, I totally made it. We're right on top of each other, dude. Oh my gosh. You're definitely in better position. The fish are losing their minds. So much to feast on. Okay, I think we need to do that one more time. I'm gonna go over here. Walk to your right just a hair. Let me hit that left side, which I don't think is any good. I don't think it's any good over there. Folks, they done threw us for a loop this morning. Oh, there we go. Yep, that's the one. Well, folks, a different day, different results. <laughs> Nothing in the corner. Let's go ahead and get on with the rest of this place. All right, is homie gone? Oh, look, he's on the phone, ain't he? Yeah, a few boys with nine fishing rods. They done hop the gate. Yeah, I got eyes on them, Captain. <laughs> <Please. laughs> We're in. Oh. Thanks for holding the camera, Bill. <laughs> what in cousin tarnation? <laughs> made it into the second pond you guys were that this is where the Giants have been caught these last couple weeks by a few buddies of mine so let's see if we can't slay a few chef bad bass should be right around the corner here well that's a good sign we walk up and chef bad bass is literally holding the fish putting putting it back in the water getting the release this is Chris <laughs> and I think the I think the heavy time is coming up at like noon chef and I took a little detour we're hitting the third pond this one looks like a total juice box I remember Bill caught one literally right by our feet where we're standing now, like first cast when we hit this one the last time and that was about it. The bite was slow here, a little bit more stained, might consider black and blue, might not. I think it's good enough. It's good enough clarity for the natural stuff. Oh, yeah. Maybe we make a couple right here All right, and then just it. move it on down. All right. I don't think it's anybody's backyard. Oh, 
There's bites. He let it go, I think. Oh, getting bumped. He's got it. That time he's got it. Oh! No! 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 How do you miss on these little hooks? How do you miss? Oh, what the heck? Oh, he looped it around the rod tip. I did whenever I said it. Dang, that would have been my first fish of the day. Holy cow. Okay, well, that was good, though. That was good. That's a good, good sign right when we get here. Better watch your rods. Got him. Golly. I'm like, I keep getting hits right here. First fish, first fish. Yes. Golly. Y'all, it has been, it has been two hours of nothing for me. Holy smokes. And again, this guy hit it. I think it's the same fish, same spot. And uh, he hit it and didn't have it. I'm just waiting to feel some weight. Finally, I feel it. Woo. Loudy, loudy, loudy. That is what we needed. That is what we needed. <sighs> Woo! First one of the day. Winter fatty, too, for how small it is. This thing's probably a pound, pound and a half. And uh, yeah, crack and crawl, just working it nice and slow. Literally, I have thrown maybe six different lures today in the last uh, two hours. And to finally catch one feels real good. We're fishing off this dock. It's such a scenic pond in this nicer community. And it's super nice to be able to put something together for you guys. Let's go ahead and see if we can't snag a couple more. Get him back in the water, and I'm gonna throw that crack and crawl a bit more. Be free, let's see if we can't watch you swim away in the shallows here. Oh, he took off right away. Crack and crawl back in the water, stack. Yep, yep, he did have it. There we go. Crack and crawl, second one. Second one on the crack and crawl. Yes! I'm telling you what, I think we found the deal. I might uh, maybe switch the color up. Natural seems to be getting it done. Uh, I only say that because it is pretty murky and the wind is really howling. So uh, possibly black and blue might get their attention a little bit easier. Um, We're going to test that theory right Test now. it, yep. Chef's going with the Texas rig right now. He is rigging up. He's seen enough! Let's go! We got two back to back. Let's keep him cranking. Just out here having a little boink. Slave fest today. Yeehaw. Hopefully you guys like that last release. I was doing a little Instagram post. <laughs> Sometimes I forget, man. It's like I'm filming for YouTube. I'm going for Instagram. I'm trying to do all this junk. <laughs> Anyways. Uh, yeah, so we got kind of a double release. Check out the stories on Instagram because obviously that's going to release right now this second. And you guys are seeing this uh, probably a couple days later. Well, maybe not a couple days later, but anyways, a lot of stuff gets showcased on the Instagram beforehand, so you might see that new PB getting caught on the story before you catch the video on YouTube. If you want first access, go ahead and follow me, Weston Smith, on Instagram. We'll see you over there. Y'all, immediately my thought process when we hit the spot was get over here and cast into these reeds, and every fish that's bit so far has just been out random points in the middle of nowhere, so I'm just going to continue fan casting and... Seeing if I can't knock one in the noggin. What's up, dude? How you doing? Good, how you been? Good. Well, I have extra setups. I could tie you something on if you want. Yeah, let's do it. See what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah let's, let's walk around that way, because I've never hit that side of the pond. Let's try something new, because we didn't really get many bites here. Just got lucky with two back to back, I think. <laughs> Guys, I was just fixing a backlash on this reel. I had casted it out for Alex. He's throwing the left-handed reel with the crack and crawl. And I go to reel in the slack and this fish is on. I wish you guys would have seen that. That really sucks. But I didn't have the GoPro rolling because I was just trying to get that knot out. Right off the dock. Let's drop him back in. It's pretty shallow here, but here's a, here's a little deep pocket under the dock. Oh yeah, he's cruising. That's funny. Chef just missed a big one too. Wow. Has he got it? Got him. There we go. On the drop shot. Just a little guy. He flew off. That was crazy. That was crazy. I'm looking for a bigger one. Yep. They are stacked in here. The wind is blowing this way, guys. It gets nice and shallow. Something about this area, they are really digging. No way. Alex is on. Alex is on. <laughs> what happened is... What had happened was, like next couple casts, we throw the crack and crawl back in. And look at this. Fat one. That's what I'm talking about. Let's get him back in the water. I would just drop him uh, straight down. Get on that release. Doink. That's like the uh, third one in 10 minutes over here. Hell yeah. <laughs> Got him. Do you really? Yeah. No way, dude. No way. Alex with another. God damn. Yep, you can set that down. Grab the bottom lip real firm, real firm. He's gonna shake, yep. Oh, snap. Yo. <laughs> that was like back to back. I know. I think that was I two casts in a row. One. No, couldn't be. <laughs> 
couldn't. No, this one's even bigger, I think. That's sick, dude. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's drop him and get some more, dude. We are on him. This is nuts. That's what happens, though, you guys. You can't just, you can't just get down because the fish aren't biting. Literally, I was stressing out over here. I was not catching nothing. Then Alex shows up and boom, boom, bing, bong, bam. So catch number two. Let's get him. Had a backlash, and I don't know if this one's coming out. Well, we might have to retire this one for the day, which is okay. We're gonna make a move to another corner over here. I think Alex and I literally pulled every fish out of this little pocket, mainly Alex. Uh, but there's another corner right here. Chef just linked up a little further out. We're gonna try and hit some uh, deeper water that leads into this little uh, nook and cranny back here. Guys, I just wanna show you the Bass Forecast app. It shows you the prime time, and it literally says from 11.35 to 1.30 p.m today is going to be the prime time to catch these fish and it's literally 12 30 right now so we're right in the middle of the prime time this app is saying we should be out here fishing and the bite should pick up and it's funny because we were catching nothing earlier and all of a sudden they've just been hitting back to back chef keeps getting hits as well and uh, i don't expect it to be very long we got our first catch off this corner we were just fishing off that dock over there and we made a small move to maybe get in this mouth it's a little bit deeper let's go ahead and get a fish i got an eighth ounce woo tungsten right here so i'm using an eighth You got one, don't you? Dude. Yeah. <laughs> Dude. Alex is just making the video today. Oh my gosh. All right, so catch number three for me for the day. Uh, this one is what? Probably about the same size as the second one. Uh, we had just actually moved from that little bridge over there or a little pod and um, I re-rigged the craw, the green one. I don't know what, what's the color name. That's nice and fresh. And so we got nice and fresh bite, baby. I'm about to let him go. Rock and roll, dude. He's putting me to shame over here, boys. <laughs> putting me to shame. Catch number three, baby. <laughs> this has been the best one, right? Caught anything yep. <laughs> Nuts, dude. That's funny. Oh, we got bites. He's on. Yeah. All right. This is probably my biggest one of the day. He's spiraling. Uh, he's he's fair. Nothing too crazy. There we go, guys. I'm on the board. Finally caught one. This is the Alabama crawl. We're throwing something a little bit different than what Alex has got with that silver flash on the bottom of his natural color. Just slightly different. It's got the green on top. And I'm telling you what, they are loving, loving the crawls, man. Super sick. Not any giants yet, which is very surprising. I hear big things about this pond, but I think we're about to link up with the big one. So stick around. Let's get him back in the water. Off. All right, let's do it. Oh, there you go, chef. Dude. What is on the hook? Tell, tell me you got something. Oh man, look at that. Oh, it's a little guy. Nice. Alex is on again. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Double back uh, flip. That's how we do it. <laughs> Let's go get some more, boys. Well, y'all, the bite has slowed down a little bit. We are needing to get out of here, but uh, we had a ton of fun. We're actually going to go check in with Bill and Chris. I assume they're still fishing in the other pond because we have not heard from them. And it sounds like they were actually catching some fish. So maybe they caught a big one. Let's go see what they're up to. Fido. I see Bill and Chris, but they're, Bill and Chris are across the pond over here. <laughs> What's up, buddy? I was just going to split. I got to get to work. So I figured I'd call you and see if you guys had caught any more. We got on a good bite over at the other pond for a minute. A cracking craws only. On the Texas rig or what? Yeah, Texas rig craws. They were like smashing it up there. Y'all have fun. I hope you get some more. All right. All right. Thanks, Peace. Man. All right, gang. We are back at the truck. Had a fantastic day. Alex really made the video, so I got to uh, say thank you, bro. I appreciate it. Thank it's you. been. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it's a pleasure. <laughs> I'm the one even getting the backlashes on these reels. Yeah, <laughs> dude. So we had a ton of fun. I hope you guys enjoyed Alex. And uh, maybe next time we'll strap him up with a GoPro. Let me know if you want to see him featured in some more. The dude's from Ukraine. He's a beast. And uh, we'd like to get him on some more fish. So maybe we can't make that happen in a future video. Everything we threw today, you can get for 30% off from the bait, the, the line, the lures, all that stuff from Carl's Bait and Tackle. You guys know to where to find them down in the description. And we'll catch y'all on the next video. Peace. Peace. Peace.